careful and make sure you pack plenty of water today. It's going to be another triple digit day. We passed our record yesterday at 110 degrees and heat is the number one weather related killer in the U.S. So like I said, drink plenty of water, take frequent breaks in the shade if possible and know the signs of heat exhaustion as like I said, could be a killer out there today. We are expecting more triple digits, although not quite as hot as what we saw yesterday, but a beautiful morning in downtown Bakersfield. We're currently sitting at a nice 78 degrees out there with that humidity at 18%. Winds out of the northeast at 5 miles per hour, so it is a gorgeous day. And temperatures around the county also looking very pleasant this morning. 57 up in the mountains in Tehachapi, 75 in Delano, and also mid to upper 70s on the west side near Button Willow and near Taft this morning, and 54 in Pine Mountain Club. But like I said, going to be heating up significantly by the afternoon. Luckily, though, some relief is on the way. We are tracking a low pressure system in the Pacific Northwest, and as this begins to move on shore as early as tomorrow and into Thursday is when we will begin to see at least a nice 10 degree cool down. But until then, our air quality still remains unhealthy for sensitive groups. So please try to stay indoors today if possible. Also, if you are still sneezing, our allergies are not good as far as our grass and tree pollens. Those are still in the moderate level today. So just be aware of that. If you do have allergies, and like I said, going to be a warm one around the valley today, still triple digit heat for most valley locations, 102 in Delano and Bakersfield and 103 in Wasco with overnight lows in the 70s. Also in the mountains going to be a warm one, although not too bad and to have to be at 88 degrees. Also mid to upper 90s in Lake Isabella and Kernville and Glenville. And finally down in the desert, still very, very hot today with a high of 106 in Ridgecrest. Taking a look at that 70 forecast, it is going to be a warm one today at 102. But if you are heading to that ceremony today for CSUB, it looks like it will be about 90 degrees for the commencement ceremony at 6 p.m. with a west northwesterly wind at 13 miles per hour. The rest of the week is not looking too bad. We will still stay in the 90s though with nice clear skies all week long and the weekend's also not looking too bad. We'll see 94 on Saturday with overnight lows in the 60s. Kern River Valley also looking nice with a high of 88 by Friday and finally in the mountains again a nice clear week with a high of 79 by the end of the week. Let's take a look outside in your traffic now. A couple accidents to report out on the roads this morning. If you're headed towards Ridgecrest on Highway 178, there is a fatal accident in both directions on Brady Street. So try to avoid that area if possible. Also, another crash on northbound 99 right past Weibel Road. That is affecting Highway 99 in both directions as well. Back to you.